guys welcome to another fresh segment of the celebrity exposure and i'm telling you guys come on how to subscribe beef beef subscribe 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 so today i'm chilling out with this fantastic guest i'm telling you guys um say like he is the og when it comes to mixing you know when it comes to the hottest mixes that you hear in kenya he is a man behind all the mixes that you've had so are you ready for this guest <laughs> Holy Ghost fire now you walk eh? White, red, a touch of red. Red, red. Yes. Nani ku dress? Eh, nini ku dress tu mnyani? Nini ku changanya changanya tu alafu? Zina zina. Okay. So we ni ni kwa niki skia DJ Sadik since I was in high school. Yes. Na say I've met you in person and you're still the same. How is it? Kiyama, what is going on? You're looking the same. Kula vizuri na kula lama pema. Kula lama pema. So, na pia gym. Juzi nilikuwa na whether he's king of TikTok. Unajaribu pia. You're so funny. You're so funny. Pika pika pika. Du du du. Dan dan dan. Du 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 du. Wen 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 wen. Wen wadi ni gani? Mimi. Hii ya kutundu. Kutundu ni gadi sasa. Kutundu hii ya ngoma hii ya ngoma. Kutoka kutung, kutoka kutung. Hiyo ni gani? Hii ya kupika ya ngoma. Wewe ni Mkristo ama ni Mkristo? Sawa. Yes, yes. Majina yako unaitwa nani? Si kuita bananga ng'a Alfonso Makacha Totmako. Unasema nini? Kwa China naitwa Alfonso Makacha Totmako na umba. Sawa, indua hii Biblia. Usinikuia mkali. Wewe, rudi hapo. Rudi hapo. Eh? Rudi hapo. Ana nikuea mkali. Asante. So TikTok ni kitu unatumia kujirelaxisha or what the motive behind TikTok? Yeah, nili most of these apps na kuanga late kuingia hata Instagram niliingia bit late but once I get the hang of it as I know fun so nili find TikTok kiyo especially yo that uh, quarantine period ile kuna tu busy na keep entertained so yeah nila na 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 kwenda hiyo yeah. Do you know I've ever done um, a TikTok and you will show it fine Oh the sound uka uka do on yeah, your yeah. I'll check it out God 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 <laughs> Ito yangalia But anyway, so DJ Sadik DJ Sadik, na squeeze na saka Sandiki Pia Iko, so where did the name come from? Sadik nilipe watu na my boys high school Yeah, just my boys wali nipati high school na nikamu wa kuran with it Because ukirisati pia ni jina inamanisha It's an Arab, yeah, Arab name inamanisha friend Ama mtu trust with it Yeah, na kusadiki pia kwa Kiswahili it's like ni kama reverence to God so I ran with it. Ni upati ya Arab you somehow look like the type ama aje wasi. Eh watu niambia. Na ndevu then na trade. Tuniambia mapo yangu na kama ya watu wa Egypt. Yeah. Alafu sasa now when it comes to DJ like watu kwa na challenges mingi sana especially the parents wako like hiyo si kitu unaweza fanya hata nikulete do. What can you tell them? Uh, unajua hii ilikuwa naweza sema tu stereotype ni kitu watu okay kitambo ungetaja DJing watu walikuwa na assume mtu uh, story ya partying na na madem yani madijo walikuwa na associate tu na kitu mbaya but i think that's one of the reasons why nilitaka sana ku ku get into DJing to kuipatia a different face because right now i have a DJ academy and 90% of my students wana let work with the with the school personally with their parents to register which means was uh, parents wakiangalia wanaona Okay kuna place Sadika amefika na hii muziki na kama mtu wangu anataka kudu music why not so i think hiyo ni kitu pia wazungu tushindia kidogo mm -hmm. because unakutanga 
wakiona mtoia kuna interest in computers they start nurturing that gift mapema so i think we should borrow a leaf peer parents if your child is gifted in area any area be it sports ama uh, ama music what support okay. yeah so now personally for your parents were they in for it ama mvuta na kidogo Uh, my my dad ali ali person nikiwa mdogo kiasi so i grown with my mom na i think initially hako ana understand what exactly i'm doing hako anaelewa ni radio presenter ama ni nini exactly ni jamaa but ali support from time nikiwa cuz nilianza story music nikiwa shule so from the time i was in school ali kwa tuana support she wasn't so clear of exactly what i want to do but ali support to i think saya na furahia yeah okay yeah so in the, in the in the process of mixing na kufanya hii kazi yako mm-hmm. like there is kumekuwa na transition mingi when okay. it comes to the gospel industry yes. you know basically hata kwa hii side nyingine as kila tunaona what's happening mm-hmm. so what can you say about the gospel industry because watu wengine wanasema gospel imeisha mm-hmm. there is no content you as a dj yeah. alafu pia do you have any criteria ndio yeah. ucheze ngoma ya msingi Uh, one thing guys need to understand uh, gospel haiwezi isha cause gospel ni nini gospel na ona ni nani unaelewa gospel ina inaoniwa na god unaelewa god ndio mwenye gospel si drop off the wagon kuna watu wanaweza decide kwenda directions zingine but the gospel will stand because ile kitu god mwenyewe ame institute yeye ndio atafinance na yeye ndio atayestablish so gospel ni ya god haiwezi isha uh, despite the different challenges ile ziko kwa industry uh, industry pia especially music inaenda ki evolve i was with the same throughout the years so kuna different styles ina come up artists pia wana embrace hizo styles mimi na mimi nasema it doesn't matter ile style mtu anafanya provided the message in it is solid na ni gospel na ina lead watu to to positive things to, to salvation me i think ina make sense na iko sawa because we also all can't sing the same way yeah so lazima kuko na hiyo diversity so uh, in the gospel gospel it remain <laughs> yeah and after this when it comes to cheza ngoma ya mtu how how do you go about that because i'm sure i will get a request yeah. like every single day cheza ngoma ya mtu cheza ngoma ya yeah, hivyo tu vile tumesema gospel song lazima ukisikiza mm-hmm. unasikia ni gospel song mm-hmm. unaona isikuwe tu just random words zime zime kwa together mm-hmm. lazima i, i, i speak message flani kwa wase mm-hmm na quality pia as much as ni gospel to sisi pia tutafanya tu vitu midioka the quality of the audio the quality of the video has to be nice mm-hmm. na message ikiwa safi pia uh, production ikiwa ikiwa fit tunacheza oh. yeah, yeah okay alafu so as we finish there's a time ni ulikuwa in 2014 yeah. you went to US for an award yeah. can you tell us about that award wow ilikuwa so humbling kukuwa invited for the Dove awards mm-hmm. Dove Awards ni one of the biggest uh, gospel awards. So ilik opportunity poor because nearly get to meet a lot of the artists wale tu nilikuwa anacheza music yao watu kama La Cree, nika meet celebrities like anaita ngwa Camila Man. Eh nika meet a lot of people like uh, all the heavyweights in the gospel industry wale kwa wale kwa pokina Ty Tribet, Fred Hammond. So you go to actually see these guys. Yes because it's a hangout ni place guy so uh-huh. after the award there's a there's a hangout watu wana have drinks watu wana wana snack. So, that's so when all you the artists to shoot your points. <laughs> all the artists are there so ni make sure nimepiga picha kama zote <laughs> ziko huko Facebook. So ilikuwa uh-huh. ilikuwa opportunity poa pia mm-hmm. uh, cause pia uh, nilikuwa na represent Groove Awards from Kenya. Mm-hmm. So ilikuwa opportunity poa ya kuona pia how they do their awards. So ilikuwa experience fit is and So unaweza sema tu ikazi isikuwe underrated. It can take you places. Ni kazi, ni kazi tu kama nyingine because uh, mimi nasema hata Bible yenyewe inasema your gift will make room for you before great men. So mimi naweza sema yes nimesoma to a certain extent but places nimeenda na mziki hata vitabu zangu ama certificate zangu hazingenifikisha hapo. So ile hivyo tu nimesema ile gift God amekupatia naturally it work on it polish it na itafikisha mahali. Okay. Yeah. So tukimaliza hii niliambia wase na kuja kufanyia DJ Sadik interview. Uh-huh. So alikuwa like muulize mm-hmm. for all those times hatujawahi sikia wedding bells mahali. Mm-hmm. So what's iko na mtu ama Ah uh, unajua mimi nasema forever is a long time. Mm-hmm. Yeah forever ni a long time because wewe mtu utakuwa na yeye for the rest of your life. So mimi nasema siki tu ya kurush. When the timing is right in God's time it will happen. So sina haraka. Okay. Kuna pressure. So, yeah. so to the young guys that are watching ukitaka kuingia genius entertainment mm-hmm. what do you do what are you doing? Uh, of course right now kuna different things that tunafanya 
tuko na the recording studio so for the artists who want to record unaweza ni dm at dj sadi kama udm genius entertainment ama genius records kwa uh, wale wasanii wanataka ku record for the dj academy same way drop me a message either on dm ya twitter facebook ama instagram uh, nitacheki si ufanya missions pia so if you want to be part of the missions team hala at us as well wakati normal si tarudi vitu zikirudi tukianza kufanya missions again we can we can tag you along so any inquiry you have about music maybe when msanii unataka kutuma ngoma internet imerahisisha vitu hata kama una namba yangu ukini ukije introduce vizuri na uniambie about yourself hapo kwa dm na utume link yako kama ngoma iko sawa tunacheza yes haya sawa nai wake tumalize nai wake kabisa haya sadika atumbie nai wake tumalize hiyo atwezi toka hapa kama tujafanya all right make sure you check out my new song inaitwa nai wake featuring silver mistarish and muhanji bado nazidi karibu chachu tanipata nikisadiki mam ni sande na robo na nitasadiki yao sio keep it low all right guys so that's all we have it for celebrity exposure see you another time in a different place with a different person this jeez friends Nipata nikisadiki mam ni sande na robo na nitasadiki usishangae mama tunapi